Hey guys, Trevor Boone from Emerald City Guitars. I've got a 1967 Fender Vibrolux Reverb, one of my favorite amps. It's really, really easy to talk about because I own three of them. I've been putting them through the test in the studio and live applications for over 15 years. I know them like the back of my hand and also what to expect from one of this era. I have two in right now that I'm really, really excited about. This is one of them, 1967. I love the Vibrolux because it's 35 watts, so it's about half as much as a twin reverb. Love the twins, but they're super heavy, and I just think they're too loud, because with Fender, you want to just bring them right to the cusp of breakup, just to kind of get them heated. You can go to about five on this, and it's really where you want it to be, and uh, it's just kind of a perfect volume for in a room like this, or stage. If you're playing with another guitar player, it's not an offensive amp, it just sits right in the pocket, great. So 35 watts, 210. So the 210 inch speakers are huge to me too. I go between a pick and just using my fingers and they're really, really quick. Rather than having 12s, the 10s are just a little bit more sensitive so you can pull some cool dynamics out of it. We've got volume, treble, and bass. Really, really approachable EQ there. You can't really find a bad tone. You got a bright switch to brighten that up if you want. That's very musical as well. The reverb is amazing. Then you've got classic Fender vibrato. Again, I'm a real big fan of guitar in one hand, amp in the other. Roll to a gig with your, your guitar and a Vibrolux and you're in a good spot. So again, 1967, I uh, handed this over to Brent Bagby, our amazing amp tech who did the three prong cable and changed out the filter caps, really straight up stuff. It's like, you know, needs to be done basically on these. So yeah, 100% approved of this amp. I think if you own this amp, you're gonna keep it forever. I can't go without them. We do a lot of demos as you've seen on Vibrolux's because they do the job. So anyways, I'm gonna plug a Strat in it today. I generally plug my Telecaster into it. Strat sounds so good through Vibrolux's. I'll try to do it justice. Let's see how it sounds.